fibroid will shrink, fibroid will disappear and vanish if you begin to eat this diet. If you begin to eat this food, fibroid will shrink and vanish from your body. Stop fibroid growth, shrink already growing fibroid and prevent fibroid. Avoid surgery by eating this food. By God's grace in today's video, I wish to share with you combination of food nutrients you will actually be eating you will never talk of fibroid if you're already a victim of fibroid gradually it will shrink away and you'll be protected from having fibroid growth knowing fully well that a number of things causes fibroid like excess secretion of one of the female secondary characteristics at the expense of another which is progesterone and the estrogen hormonal imbalance and then the type of diet we eat environmental factors as well as hereditary factors but if you follow me to the end of today's video i'll give you a lasting solution to fibroid treatment but before then please give this video a thumbs up so that youtube algorithm will shift it to other people that need it so do so may god bless you before i go ahead in this video please press the like button right now press it if you have not done so god will bless you as you press so if this is the very first time you are finding yourself in this beautiful family you are highly welcome please kindly hit the red subscribe button and the bell notification so as to always get my next upload for my returning subscribers i love you so much thank you for always stopping by so with your western time let's dive in in as much as I know that there is no one particular food that can guarantee 100% fibro shrinkage, I know very well that if you will have a combination of this food I am going to be talking about, forming your balanced diet and stop some of the ones I am going to tell you to stop, to a great extent, if you have not become a victim of fibro, it will never happen to you. Then if you have fibro, it will gradually shrink till you are free from it. And to a great extent, you will also notice that your hormonal imbalance situation, if your own is caused by hormonal imbalance, will balance. And I wish to say this, that even though you go to hospital, the option to remove fibro, especially if your fibro is already big, is surgery, there is still a kind of hope at the end of the tunnel i've made a number of videos on how you can actually shrink fibroid naturally in addition to there is a certain product i am selling called stencil stencil is a new breakthrough in medical science and i have another one that is a combination of stencil and epigenetics that one way or the other it helps to find out all the cells that are underperforming the ones that over performing and the cells that are damaged and then repair those cells and bring it to normal functionality of equilibrium and that is why such product helps to tackle some issues that seem that the last resort to solution to it is actually surgery by god's grace if you can get that product from me and you are able to combine it effectively with the food nutrients i'm going to be explaining to you you will not only say bye bye to surgery you will notice that if you already have surgery god by his infinite mercy will make you to be free from it so please if you are already a patient try and get it and uh, prevention is always better than cure so it is also necessary that you get it for preventive purposes because actually it repairs your entire system and your kidney liver heart every part of your body all needs maintenance because any day any time prevention is always better than cure so without wasting time let's get to into the onions of those video first of all if you can stop high concentrated carbohydrate foods and red meat fibroid will not have power in your body something like coco yam yam rice if you will reduce it to a great extent fibroid will not have power over your body and then red meat fried foods and the flour made food or flour made snacks fried snacks like fried eggs fried buns fried donuts fried other things like yam and then meat pie chicken pie all the pie 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 cake and others stop eating some of these things 
fibroid will be weak in your system i will not have a choice than follows now these are the food nutrients you must focus on number one is fiber rich food high fiber rich food like grains oats when i mean oats i mean poker oats beans rentios and all forms of vegetables help to regulate all estrogen levels so that there will not be excess secretion of estrogen at the expense of progesterone which are the female hormones that causes fibroid you will notice that your fibro growth will begin to shrink or if you'll never have fibro at all it will never be part of your system number two is you must incorporate variety of fruits especially citrus fruits in your diet because they are rich in antioxidants and vitamin c that will actually help you to get rid of every form of growth especially fibro fruits like orange tangerine lemon lime and the grape also fruits like carica papaya that is popo that is popo berries and others are very good in helping to reduce the size of fibro and when you make it a continuous food to a great extent you will notice that fibro has shrink away like know very well that no sickness will actually thrive in alkaline environment one of the things that lime and lemon helps you to do is to put your body in alkalized environment and you can also combine it with some pineapple so all you need to do is to cut some pineapple because the pineapple once it's sweet or warm the ones is, that is called when pineapple it will it has to dilute the sour taste of lemon and lime so if you get lemon and lime or lemon on lime uh, uh, get in warm water and squeeze them inside then get cut um, some pineapple or blend it into paste and then mix it together and be drinking it from time to time before you know it you will not talk of fibro again the next one you need is reefy green vegetables of course you can never do without it if you can engage in eating dark reefy vegetables like spinach a lot of spinach kale pumpkin they are highly rich in iron and fiber and iron supplies you quality healthy blood and those fiber helps in digestion and evacuating any form of growth you will notice that with time those fibrous cells will weaken and shrink away or even detach from your body the next one is lean proteins you need to make choose food that are rich in lean protein and start eating them immediately something like chicken remove every form of red meat from your diet and replace it with chicken because they are white and meat and that is lean protein and the way you want to eat that you can scrape the back the skin remove the skin and eat the inside likewise turkey fish and the others but be sure they that they are organically produced that is not the one that they use booster to produce and that is why i will always recommend for you to go for locally made chicken locally made locally trained turkey because most of these agri ones they use booster and those booster will furthermore encourage the growth of fibro likewise most of the fish are booster made to extend that uh, there are some fish that are even pl plastic and such as those are, that are imported from abroad depending on where you are located so you have to be careful if possible meet local vendors of this particular food, uh, food item lean protein and be sure that they are growing it organically with organic made food and not boosters when you start eating them it will not only supply the needed nutrient to make your nutrient balance but you will notice that at a time you will say bye bye to fibro no matter the size then the next one is this you have to engage in healthy fat remember that in as much as you want to shrink fibro you must still engage in balanced diet there are food that should never leave your food now instead of some of this artificial oil artificial fat that is not good for you getting fried buns fried uh, donut and other fry 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 egg go for avocado pear because avocados they actually contain natural fat and then go to different nuts and seeds like walnut granite but depends on your blood group because if your blood group oh 
excess granola is not actually an, a good for you you may need to get my video on how to eat according to your blood group so that is right away so if you can start eating nuts and then other seeds that is very good for instance avocado pia you can actually dry the seed and blend it and use it to form tea it's very very good then pan kernel especially on ripe to one if you start eating all this to a great extent you will say bye bye to fibro the next one is dairy or dairy alternative in other words alternative for milk now instead of eating cow or goat milk which you are not even sure is 100 percent cow or goat they process other things and add there why not go for almond milk get almond seed and process it into milk in other words blend it and use it as milk add it a little bit of water and then you can actually go for tiger nut can go i've made that video in genuine action tv you can blend tiger nut completely and drink it as your milk that is alternative milk you can go for coconut blend it and drink it as milk instead of all this goat and cow milk because the goat and cow milk will actually help to feed those fibrous cells and they will grow bigger but this dairy product i talk about alternative almond milk and then coconut milk tiger nut milk will actually help to shrink it and you will be more healthy reason is because they contain lots and lots of calcium and vitamin d then the next one is you need to go for omega fatty acid food food that has have lots of omega and fatty acid because it has some anti-inflammatory properties that will further more help to shrink those fibroid food like salmon a type of fish and then walnut they are they are rich in this omega-3 fatty acid if you start eating it you will also have your fibro shrink again is you can never underestimate the power of herbal teas green tea is very very necessary a kind of get green tea and be drinking that is made from vegetable then get ginger tea clove tea in the sense that you can actually boil clove like three to five minutes enough clove like up to 20 21 pieces and you drink the water ginger tea from time to time you blend ginger and then into powder and form tea with it and drink it have anti-inflammatory effect in your body that will actually help to shrink the fibroid very fast like i've said stay away from red meat because they help to empower and higher the estrogen level avoid excess sugar and all the processed food because it causes inflammation in other words stay away from any form of artificial sugar you can actually go for original farm made honey if you actually want anything that has to do with sugar you can get it from me especially this hibiscus tea flour is also very very good to stop fibroid when you boil it with negro pepper and then with ginger you may not be able to take it except there is a little bit of sweetener sweeten it with original farm made honey not ordinary sugar or not any form of flavor those things that have content of saccharin which is not good for your health and even help to empower the estrogen the next one is always be hydrated drink enough water when you wake up in the morning first thing you must do is drink two glass cup of water in the night before you go to sleep after you have eaten everything give like one hour and take a glass of warm water especially warm water that warm water that have some infusion of pineapple and then lemon and lime into it and drink it go and sleep you will see the awesome power of god healing you from that fibroid and again you have to manage your weight overweight obese people are more prone to fibroid growth so pay attention to your weight management and of course these food items i call to a great extent when you concentrate on them it will manage your weight and believe me no distant time you come back to testify how your fibroid has shrinked or how suddenly your fibroid has fallen off and don't forget to come and uh, buy your stem cell because it's going to go a long way to help you so please if you have not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe hit the bell notification so as to always get my next upload comment on this video share it to everyone my share will be helping a lot of people so do so mega blessing so with this i say enjoy your day